Okay, we're back again. We've got the Mew V Force tin today. Let's go. Hey guys, let's get straight into this today. We've got another V Force tin to open and see if we can finally get something good out of these. I'm not sure if you've seen my previous video, but I've opened four of these now and I've not had the best luck, so hopefully things are going to change soon. You would hope so. Is that in shot? Yeah, it's in shot. Ping. Right, I'm, if you've never seen these, this just comes with a Mew card. Um, I think this Mew's from Darkness Ablaze, maybe? I can't remember. It's Darkness Ablaze or Rebel Clash. I'm pretty sure it's Darkness Ablaze, though, if I'm honest with you. It's not a promo card, it's just a card on the tin and it comes with four packs as well. So every pack, or every tin rather, you get two Vivid Voltage, you get a Sword and Shield base art, and you get a Breakpoint EX, or XY, sorry, not EX. So I'm gonna start off with a Breakpoint pack, which felt super loose. Um, I've not had anything good out of this, but I really like these tins and there's a really cool Gyarados you can get. So it's three from the back on an XY era pack. And then let's start, see what we can get. So we're starting off with a Durant. Cricketone, we've got a Shelder, a Psyduck, a Phantom, a Slowpoke, a Shinx. Hey, now that's cool. Reverse Valley. I don't think these hold much value, but they are super cool reverse cards. Reverse Valley. Hey, and a Garbodor holographic. It's quite cool, that actually. I'm not sure if you can see that. That's so cool. I really like that art. That's awesome. But I'm a big fan of this Reverse Valley. Definitely an underrated card. It kind of looks like those full art gold cards that you can get in Sun and Moon, like is it Cerulean City or Viridian Forest maybe that has them? Really good. I think that's two good hits. I'm really happy with them. I don't think they're the most valuable, but probably the best hits I've had in these XY packs so far. Now let's go with a Chunky Pikachu pack. Come on you big fat Chunky Chew. What we got in this one? We're gonna go four from the back and let's go. So we're starting off with a Darkness Energy, a Mag Cargo, Nessa, a Swellow, or an amazing rare would be good. Could we get a double hit pack? That would be so good. Nope, we have a Reverse Wishma and a Drapion V. So just a V card. I got a V card in the last one I opened, actually. Stone Journey V, I think it was. Um, not the most valuable cards, but they're still hits. Nice enough to get. So, so far, we're doing pretty well. We've had two kind of hits, not big hits, not great hits. We've had a holographic and a V card, but it's a lot better than what I've had previously out of these tins. We're going with Sword and Shield base set. I always say this, but on these base sets, um, the cards that you want to get are the Zashian and Zamazenta gold cards. Snorlax, Rainbow, I believe, is also up there in value. Pokegear, Sudowoodo, and an Eldegoss. A Cupant, a Ball Toy, a Chinchow, Sizzlipede, Galarian Zigzagoon. We've got a Reverse Snom, and behind it, hey, we have a full art hit. We've got a Wobbuffet V. This is the best tin I've opened so far. If I were to just purchase this tin by itself, I would think, wow, I've done pretty well here. But that's a, a good full art to get. I don't think it's high in value, probably not. I mean, full art cards are, seem to be more collectible. People want them. I guess it's because the arts are a lot nicer as well. Uh, big fan of that, it's a great hit. Super happy. Okay, we are on to last pack magic now, ladies and gentlemen. We have a Vivid Voltage Zarud pack. Um, we've got a V card out of the last Zarud card. We get something in this one. Not sorry, not a V card in the Zarud pack, a V card in the Pikachu pack. Okay, here we go. So we're starting off with a Leaf Energy. And then we have Dra Drone Rotom, not Drain Rotom, Extra Drill, Drill Burn, a Whalmer, a Cottony, Clobopus, a Electric. We got a Reverse Memory Capsule, so no amazing rare. And behind it, a Deancey Holographic. Okay, so let's do a quick roundup. So every um, pack will have been a white code card because we got a hit in every pack. Two holographics will get you white code cards. I really like this Garbodor art. This Deante art is pretty decent as well, to be fair. But some good hits there. Really happy with that. Then we got the Reverse Valley. Probably not, like I say, a huge value one, but I think it's a super underrated art here when it comes to cards. So super happy with that one. We've got the Drapion V. Again, not a super expensive card, but a hit nonetheless. And the, probably the biggest hit of the video, which is Wobbuffet V Full Art. 
Don't forget to like and subscribe. We've got one more of these tins that we're going to be opening, which is the Galarian Slow Bro. Look out for that. I'll see you next time. Peace.